One passion I have since few years is um, I have a passion for vintage watches. The reason is that you have the same look at it as, or me, I have the same look at it as um, into an interior. So you have the first look, you have the second look, and you go really deep into details. That's the reason why I took watches as an inspiration. A 5 Series is meant to be a business suit, a tailor-made business suit. I wanted to create a contrast between a business sedan, which is really calm and quiet and serious, and a sporty sedan, let's say. In the interior, you have a certain life in the surfaces. That is what meant with wind flow, this kind of movement you feel when you have kind of a, a silk or something in the wind, you get this movement. You see it in each surface, but in the first glance, when you look into the car, you see the big surfaces, which has this kind of flow. And when you go deeper in the second glance, in details, you see it in small surfaces and little areas. Each interior has a corner which is really challenging. And I had this corner in this interior. It was the surface between the instrument cluster and the monitor. Really challenging. We spent a lot of time. I had a really, really good modeler, Tom Obermeier, and I think it took about almost one month to, to get handle this corner. But the important thing is that it works from every point of view. The center console as well was for sure challenging because I didn't want to make it boring. For that reason, I took a shape which is kind of peak and valley contrast. It's much more dynamic than just to have a 90 degree angle at, at some corner. The proportion is important. To have a lightness, to have this kind of tension, the sportiness. The first thing you see, the material separation. So the interplay between leather and wood, for instance. If you go deeper and you have a, a closer look into details and lines, you should discover lines which have much more curvature in itself. And the second line pair describes the sporty car with much more tension, with life in itself. 